What's up guys? Welcome back to the channel. Here we are with another reaction. In this we have Afterlife Series 2 Episode 4. We are absolutely fine through this show. If you happen to enjoy, please don't forget to subscribe. Give the video a thumbs up. Let's see what we got. Can't even have no toast to himself. I didn't tell you to deny it. Two fires at work on fire. What for? Flashing. What fat or bad? I don't know. I've got a lot of stuff. Right. I've got to go. Alright. It's your own way. Get out. Right? What is it? A woman suing a doctor for a box surgery. Right. Some of those old cars, do not they? I could have done with the egg, but forget him. I love Pat, bro. Yeah, sorry. Uh, what time you get out? Uh, about 10. I got it at 4. Completely smashed. Covered in kebab and fanny juice. Don't ask me how. I wasn't going to too much to try. Oh, what the hell? So I was lying in bed. I went off and then boom. Shower. Coffee. Sit <laughs> straight down the dry cleaners. What? <laughs> <laughs> I got home and cried a little bit. Try claims he used to have shared himself to us. Right, uh, just sorry to go back to uh, me. I, um, I think that I was crying because I don't want to give up on it. You know, I don't want to give up on us. And all I want to do is just talk to her and beg her to let us go back to how it was. I, I think that's hard. I can't like genuinely. I feel like I used to like see stuff like this and just be like, bro, just like move on, like just. But now, like it's it. I, I see it so much differently because like now I, I found my life and now I, I I know exactly what finding the one feels like, what that kind of love genuinely feels like. And so now, like, I can understand his perspective because if I were to ever move that, bro, like, I feel like it would just be absolute pain. Like, like I don't know. It's like losing your best friend, your the person that you want to share everything with, the person that you just you want to be around. Like, and so I can't imagine ever losing that. So I can understand him and want him to. See, I just, I just want things to go back to where they were. I want to beg her. I just, I just want to be with her. I don't want to give up. So when you love someone that deeply, it's just, you can't. You gotta keep fighting. I don't want to stifle her. I don't, we don't want this. Okay? It's pathetic. Begging. <laughs> How is that good for a family? <laughs> Females choose mates based on their strength. Their capabilities to provide and keep them safe. Their capabilities to provide and keep them safe. Fucking cave. <laughs> we go out, we kill a saber tooth tiger, we bring it back, we share it out, and then we give the fittest bird a fucking seed to. That's what we're from. <laughs> yeah, I said, I think that's really. 
He said it's nature. No, it's not. Being here will not win her back. It's as simple as that. You've tried that. Didn't work. She thinks you're a loser. Solution? Oh. Be somebody else. Be something fucking better. Oh. Be something fucking stronger. Oh. Lie. Cheat. Just be a man. But not yet. When did you start? Uh, oh, I, I, I mean, he delivers it very harshly. It gets delivered in a harsh sense. But, but, I mean, he could be like it. I mean, you know, I like him as a therapist. I like him as a life coach. Like, be something effing better. Be something effing stronger. Right? Say, say, you try me and you. That didn't work. That's tough. That's tough, dude. You try me and you. That didn't work. Be stronger. Be better. Okay. All right. I can get down with that advice. I've all this stuff. About five years ago, started on, like, Botox and, like, filler for wrinkles and that. Oh, Lord. How old are you? I've seen her before. So Early weird. 20s. Has she acted in anything else? Y'all talk to me, comment, say she. What wrinkles did you have? I don't know, like, frown lines and that. Right. Yeah, and then I proper got into it. I just couldn't get enough. And then I got my lips done. And I had a bit of a reaction, but that settled down in the end. And then I wanted to go bigger. Then this happened. My whole face was paralysed. So it's gone back to normal. Has it? My boobs leak. Oh. They're fake and all. Are they? <laughs> oh. Rock. Yeah. I, uh. That's okay. That's, that's not cool. That's. Yeah, you got too obsessed with it. Yeah. I need to get Sorry. my bike in. And that was the same guy that did your face? Yeah. I was furious. Still am. I am. Hard to tell. <laughs> I was furious. I still am. Are you? It's hard to tell. <laughs> See my minge. Oh Lord. It's like a butcher's bin. Oh. So okay. You went back to him to have your. Yeah, I know. I didn't want to say that. Yeah, he did it for half price though. Cause they ruined my face. Oh my days. Why would you want to have that done? I think I got a problem. A yeah. slight one. A slight one. Like an addiction. Do you mean like I can't help it? Well, I guess so, but if you acknowledge it, there's a chance you can get you know, get help. Do you think I'm mental? No more than the rest of us. As I say, we're all screwed up in one way or another. So it makes you normal. <laughs> Fine. Oh, fuck my tear ducks. <laughs> they have my tear ducks, bro. <laughs> Jeez. Take a Cause Kat is gonna express how she feel like it ain't no like straight up like I like you I think you're handsome all right hey we're all going to this thing you want to go with me she asking you out the other day she ain't afraid to take the initiative and my guy like I said if if getting back with his wife is truly what he wants then 
I say you go for that. To be honest, love cats, but like I said, I know how losing that lovely life feels. Well, I don't know how it feels, but I can't imagine that I would want to know how it feels. Um, but if you don't think it, it, it can be fixed, then give cats a shot. So, let's keep going. She a big girl, she can take it. She likes you. And yeah, we know that you, that you went through the most unimaginable loss that a person can go through. But it's either even though you went she came she she can't wait for you forever. Like like she understands, but at the end of the day if if you can't get past your wife, and if you can't, that's completely understandable. She seems very amazing. But if you can't move past her, then don't hold it against her. Right? Because she wants to find love. And if you're not if your if your heart's not available, then you can't say, I want to be with you, but I can't get over my life, so and expect her to wait around on that. It's not fair. It'll always be just a drink though.
remember that right. Such a good guy. You're such a good guy, man. Did I embarrass myself in that then? Definitely not. Why would you be embarrassed about being honest and saying something nice? You should be flattered. Think you were scared? <laughs> I think you were scared. Someone just got there first. Um, you didn't do anything wrong. You showed your feelings. That's good. Or should I show my feelings more? With Lisa. Um, I, sometimes I'd be embarrassed to hold hands in public. Or if we were on the phone and there was people around, she'd always say, bye, love you. And I'd go, me too. And she'd laugh because she'd know. Yeah. Sometimes I was out working late, the phone would go, and I'd think, oh my god, what's happened? And I'd go, hello? No, what's wrong? And, um, she'd say, nothing's wrong. I just love you. So, when one day you'll meet someone, and it'll be, life will be brilliant. So, uh, nothing to feel sad about. Not yet. This show, man. This show. Tony's, I'm telling you, Tony's one of the best freaking guys because uh, he just cares for other people so, so much. And that's, that's such a beautiful thing. Tony's such a, a perfect human, man. Such a perfectly imperfect, not perfect, such a perfectly imperfect human. Um, yeah. He 
may seem all hard and rigid, and but he's really just a big softy. Really a big softy. I'm gonna uh, walk. Uh, uh, thanks for the coffee. So. Oh, and thanks for telling me that thing about your wife, Colin. It's lovely. It's all right. See you later. Sam. proud of. Just that. I won at life. You did. I'm not as good as her, and I'm proud of that. You're just different. I'm angry, I'm petty, I'm sad, I'm jealous of anyone who's still got someone. How did you get Lisa if you were so bad? Exactly. I'm not sure. You're it's a nice throw, I think. You should try that again. <laughs> I miss her so much. I feel sad all the time. I'm not the person I was. Lisa dying, I, it's like... I lost most of me and all the good stuff, all the happiness. Enjoy it. I feel like I'm nothing, you know. That's not true. People think that I'm sort of okay, you know, like I'm getting on with it, I'm snarky now and again, and that this is a lapse. But it's not. This is me all the time now. Everything else is the front, you know. I'm not well, but I remember what it was like to be normal, so I do an impression of that. But this is what I really am. And I want to be normal again. But I'm weak, you know? When Lisa was dying, I tried to be brave and put a, you know, a face on to be positive. And even then, I'd break down sometimes and she'd have to comfort me. I couldn't even give her that. When she was dying, she was still on you. Looking after me. She'd have loved her. I do. Because I'm a woman too. And it's better to be needed. <laughs> I'm telling you, this, this show, it, it takes you all over you know, with your emotions. It takes you hills and valleys. Hills and valleys, man. Brings you up takes you down, brings you up, takes you down, um, but yeah, you just, I, I, I can't imagine, I can't imagine being in his shoes, I, it, it, I can't even think about it, like, I, I truly hate to even think about it. Be strong, everybody's struggling, it's not always their fault. There's a porter here with a bit of a B.O. problem. I'm quite glad you haven't bumped into him, to be honest. <laughs> he stinks. And do you know why? Because he's working twice as hard as everyone else. He's always running around doing stuff for other people. He's got no idea. And I was going to say something. Do you know what came out? Thank you for working so hard. And he nearly cried. Just tell people you appreciate them now and then, yeah? There you go. There you go. Right. 
please don't. A lot of people are buying it, and um, I mean, how much would you make from selling it? Half a million. Right. <laughs> yeah. How much would you make from selling it? Half a million. That's that's nothing to sneeze at. That's that's, that's, that's a pretty nice chunk of change. to somebody asking him please don't sell it like he obviously doesn't need the money uh, he doesn't have a need for anything so this paper saves his life and, and it helps all the people in that office so please just keep it going isn't it rich aren't we a pack you know what you were doing the lyrics right start it again come on okay all right all right don't think about it, do it. Sing it like it means something. Isn't it rich? Start again, so I can hear it. Isn't it rich? Are we a pair? No, again, isn't it rich? Ken, I can't do it, all right? Who's going to be a superstar okay. in a year if he listens to his director? Thank you. Now, come on, do it again. Just Sing do it with just the dance. dance. What are you trying to say can to I me, Can I do James? the dance on its own? If I did it with just the dance? He doesn't work well under fucking... pressure. Ken, stop shouting at him. Stop, stop, stop. Like that. I'm so sorry you had to see that. <laughs> I'm trying to create the best scenario. All right, you can do it without words. Thanks, Ken. All right, just the dance. Is that what you want to do? Yeah. If that makes you happy, even if it's shit, and it will be, I want you to be happy. All right? Thanks, this is why Ken. we do it. It's all right. Hey, have I talked about this? This is English yet. No. I don't think so. Right, listen up. Silly cow is only a minute bleached. Bleached. That's the thing now. Bleaching your anus. I said, for the love of God, why are you doing that? She said, so it looks nice. I said, fuck me, who's gonna see that? <laughs> <laughs> I said, mine's like a fucking composty. Mine's like an effing composty. <laughs> what are you talking about? I was telling her about my sister's anus. I'm fascinated with the anus. Always have been, always will be. The man who is tired of the anus is tired of life. You can quote me on that. You can call me on that! How's your material going? I'll keep it loose. I'm sort of like a performance artist, so I can't be constrained in the normal way. Well, you've got ten minutes, so you better keep it that time. Ten minutes? I can't do everything in ten minutes. Oh, fuck me. Sort it out between you. I'm off for a vape. If you want me, I'll be in the disables. If you want me, I'll be in the disables.
so freaking awesome, man. Oh, look at shared was something that was truly, truly special. And the fact that it's gone now is truly, truly painful. Um, it's amazing watching this show. It takes you through hills and hills and valleys. Uh, but that's all we got for episode four. I hope you enjoyed. If so, don't forget to subscribe. Give the video a thumbs up. I'll see y'all next time.